welcome back to YouTube's fastest growing segment, Random Skater of the Week, brought to you by Skull Candy, the number one headphone in skateboarding, and hosted by our friend Davis Torgerson. Thank you for coming back to season two of Random Skater of the Week. Let's get a quick breakdown of the rules before we get into yeah. it. Yeah, we haven't done this in a while. It's uh, been like months. Yeah, so from what I remember and what we were doing... <laughs> We, uh, I will be providing clues to said random skater. The two of you will have three guesses to guess this random skater. Whoever gets it first wins. You know, if you guess wrong, that's okay. You still have two guesses left. Um, I think we were saying maybe uh, if you guess three times and you don't get it, the other person wins by default. I guess that's mm -hmm. just so we have a winner. We'll stick with that. Because, uh, you know, we're going to have to keep track of, you know, your guys' record by the end of the season and mm -hmm. see who really is the skate nerd. Yep. I'm not trying to shoot my shot early like Mason. Okay. <clears throat> this random skater of a random week. <laughs> I'm going to go back to some previous teammates. I always liked that one. Some previous teammates of this skater. Justin Figueroa. Ernie Torres and Fred Gall. Damn. Damn. Okay. This random skater was in a band called Fisticuffs. <laughs> where they played guitar and possibly sang every once in a while. Possibly. Fuck. Fisticuffs. You don't you don't have any Fisticuffs records? No. Is it Braden says a Fransky? <laughs> it is not Braden. Ah! Oh, uh, damn. I don't play damn. games, bro. Fuck, Dave, why you do me like that? Look at Donald trying to fucking throw damn. guesses out now. That's a good guess. I mean, how, how the hell did you pronounce his name, bro? <laughs> <laughs> I'd never do. You that would actually it. be a sick skater to do and, and just constantly be like, no, that's incorrect. Got to pronounce it. Got to pronounce it right. <laughs> Four uh. hours later. All right. All right. One down. One guess down for Dono. He's still got two left, though. Still got two left. I admire that. I admire that. <laughs> this random skater was featured in one of the Tony Hawk Pro Skater games. Fuck, not this again. We're back to the THP original. Was featured in one of the Tony Hawk Pro Skater video games. This random skater pole jammed over Bam's crotch. <laughs> oh, hell not. <laughs> it's in a band, man. It's just gotta have some fucking nar to him. I like, I like that clue. You guys don't remember that? No. Fisticuffs? Pole jam over Bam's crotch? Oh, no. Man, no. Hmm. Fuck. Okay. Before this skater was sponsored, at the age of 15, on a trip out to California, this skater was invited to skate a backyard ramp through a friend of his sister. When they showed up to skate the ramp, it the ramp was being skated by Chris Pastris, Tommy Guerrero, and Jim Thebo, and it ended up being Jim Thebo's backyard ramp. This guy's old. He's got some age to him. Can you imagine, like, never meeting a pro before and then showing up to that backyard ramp session? Dude. Fuck, man. Okay. We're going to keep it going. Dude, is it Mike Maldonado? It is not Mike Maldonado. Oh. Can you do that shit with the Oh, oh. Oh. One more guess, baby. Should I just sit back? <laughs> Safe over here just 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 listening. You're such <laughs> a good listener. <laughs> this random skater turned pro for consolidated skateboards. That is the quietest this show has ever been. <laughs> Nathan ain't got a clue right now, bro. Okay. 
<laughs> this skater had the cover of Thrasher magazine, and on it, it said, the biggest grind of all time. John Cardiel? No. It is not Cardiel. Which, maybe you're thinking of that photo, perhaps? Dude, I... You know? You, know? Yeah, you got the gold rail last... behind you? Got the gold yes, rail behind man. me. man. It is not Cardiel. Okay. Seifa has two guesses left. Dono has one guess left. We are in a heater. This one could be a biggie. Could be a biggie. This skater's brother-in-law is Billy Joe Armstrong from Green Day. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> oh, I thought this was more common knowledge. Okay. All right. Green Day. Brother-in-law. His sister is married to Billy Joe, the lead singer of Green Day. I'm going to list some bands that this skater skated to. Bands include Vast, Thing A Thing, Slayer, Ebony Rhythm Band, The Smiths, and Crime Inquire. It never helps, man. No, you, you don't. You don't remember that Vast song? Oh, dude. All right, we're Can gonna we start keep it doing going. things that rhyme with his name. <laughs> Schmick Schmenson. <laughs> this skater started a board brand with artist Todd Bratru. Oh man, God, it's Wait. just so shit being on the last guess. Um, hold up, how many I missed board that clue, brands? Man. I, I missed this, that clue. This skater started a board brand with artist Todd Bratru. Dude, fuck it, man. Is it Chris Markovich? <laughs> it is not Chris Markovich. <laughs> I wouldn't have done that. Oh, uh, wow. Keep going to see if you'll get it. Wow. You know what? We have a winner, and it is Seifa by default, which oh. almost doesn't count. It doesn't but count, dude. It counts. Give me one more guess for it counts. just for fun. And let's keep this, going. This random skater owns and operates a skate shop and skate park. Carrie gets. Nope. This skater. That's a good. Pop guess. shoved Wallenberg four in San Francisco. Oh fuck. Steve Nesser. Yep. It was Steve Nesser. Dude, I was pretty Let's close. Fuck you, go blood. Yeah, whether he had a guess or not, it was a rap, baby. <laughs> that was wild. Oh. oh, I'm sorry, Steve. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Your uh, your random skater appearance was a default victory, a victory nonetheless. And Bro, Safa starts. That, yo, yo Safa Donald... starts the season one and zero. Oh. Let's go, oh. baby. Donald in the right. loss column. That, that, that just don't know right. shit about Steve Nestor's pop shove. Nah, Come on, that wasn't gonna help me either. <laughs> I didn't want to drop the pop shove opener, early, man. I, was yeah, I really thought uh, the Billy Joe Armstrong clue was was gonna was gonna be the one to do it. Uh, I thought that that was a bit more of uh, no. general knowledge. I was I, I wasn't know. doing anything yeah. for me. Anyways, so, so twenty twenty four. Let's go, baby. Safe got lucky. Davis killed it again. Tune in next week. Random skater of the week brought to you by Skull Candy. Check out the headphones. As clean as they come, man. It's crispy out here, audio wise. <laughs>